So would you please tell us who you are and where you're from? Yeah, uh, my name is Paul de Maagd. I'm originally Dutch, uh, but I was stupid enough to fall in love with a Flemish girl. So I live in Ghent in Belgium in the weekends. Uh, during the weekdays, I either work in Amsterdam or in London mainly for my clients. And what uh, are you doing here? What I'm doing here? Uh, that's a really good question. Um, I was invited to uh, tell something about um, actually doing stuff, doing less advertising and doing more stuff as companies. Um, and when I started Speakers Liner, but also the fact there are so many students today, I actually couldn't wait to, uh, to be here. So what is the essence of your presentation? Well, the essence is that, um, especially lately, we've seen too much advertising and companies should change this from doing actually advertising, communicating to doing stuff. And it isn't only about doing personalized small acts like doing handwritten notes or doing great service. But it's also about managing expectations from consumers. And what you're seeing there is that consumers expect more and more from companies. Uh, reply on that tweet within 15 minutes, uh, making sure that they get a present when, they're, when it's their birthday. Um, and that's really, really challenging for companies. And I offered some solutions there uh, for companies, but also for students to pursue. So I, and especially for students, I hope that they're less in the communication business and more in actually doing cool stuff business. So how will the topics of your presentation change our daily lives? Uh, well, what I hope is after our presentation that students are creating less uh, posters and less websites and actually start experimenting. Like, um, there was an example in my presentation about if you do a handwritten thank you on receipts, uh, you get a 20%, 27% uh, higher tip on general. Uh, that would be something to test if you work in a bar or in any other place. And I really, really hope students are trying this kind of stuff to do personalized stuff and just testing what works. All right, and what do you think is the worth of uh, things like this, like Multimania, conferences like this? What's the worth in them? What's the worth yeah. of a conference like this? Yes. Well, I, f I think it's, it's, it's for students, but everyone who attended today, it's, it's, it's brilliant. Uh, we've seen so, so many amazing speakers from uh, Media Monks, one of the top digital agencies in the world, uh, to Gelatology, which is a brilliant company founded by two guys who worked at Bundel Agency, one of the Belgian agencies, uh, about uh, using humor to change people's behavior to all the other companies who were here. And I think that's, that's really, really enriching, not only for speakers, but especially for students and other, and other attendants. Perfect, thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs>